Welcome to Roleplay Roulette, where we take the bullets for you. This is a new series here on the channel. We're going to be doing a series of retrospectives, looking back at games we've already reviewed, but with eyes that have had some time between then and now to maybe change our opinions a little bit. Today, we are taking a look at The World of Darkness, which was our first review under the revamped Roleplay Roulette. Right, specifically New World of Darkness. Yes, that right. is important. Especially right. because we're sitting in this fun little window where New World of Darkness has become Chronicle of Darkness. So yeah. I think now we can pretty much put a pin in the New World of Darkness. It's yeah. kind of phased out it's at done. this point. Yeah. Old World of Darkness represent, represented such a quantum, quantum leap. I don't think my feelings have changed about it. I think, I think Chronicles has some interesting innovations, but I think that New World of Darkness is still a fine thing to own and to play. And I do feel kind of browbeaten into into upgrading because there's so much cool stuff coming out yeah. for Chronicles. <laughs> I feel like the New World of Darkness, uh, the 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 World of Darkness as we reviewed it, is still amazing. And if someone calls, you know, someone that says. Yeah, I'm gonna run World of Darkness. Uh, Chronicles of Darkness? No, I'm gonna run the old one. Still well worth a look, right. well worth oh, a yeah. play. I have loved some of the stuff that's coming out for Chronicles of Darkness yeah. as well. So I'm yeah. just a, kind of an Onyx Path fanboy in a way along that line. Yeah. Well done. Taking a quick, and then taking a quick look at the video we did on it. Oh yeah. Really, if you go back and watch it, um, you, are, you can see me before I was out. Yeah, true. <laughs> um, well, I was going to say, none, none of us have really changed our minds on it, have we? No. Nope. So you no, can get our thoughts. I think that's and, what we're getting. Yeah, there. Get our thoughts yeah. and feelings on it by watching it. You can also see how embarrassingly bad we were at our jobs. Oh, it was so monotonous. Oh, it's, oh. And, you know, if you, you think I'm it, dry I, you know, now? Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> if I ever come across um, as not having a lot of energy, uh, you could always go back to when I was trying to perform and be cool back then. That was also our first foray into filming outside. Yeah. Yeah. Which went actually pretty decent. It wasn't I think that it bad. went okay. Honestly, um, I think it went better than our second foray when we had better equipment and know-how. It's uh, true. Yeah. It just, I had a hard time getting that to look good, that whole set that we were trying to use. Right. Um, Speaking of, that set would uh, look great in mysterious <laughs> places, which oh, is, excuse me. in my opinion, the absolute best supplement for just World of Darkness. It's not a supplement to any actual this one is, game. This one is Pretty excellent. Good. Yeah. It, it, this, if I remember correctly, this is the one, this is one that, it's that thing where it takes that, you know, that place that's kind of unsettling, gives you the heebie-jeebies in the real world. Yeah. And reveals how it's because there's a horrible primeval murder ghost that lives there in the in the world of dark. The Canby to... House would have been a good place yeah, for a game. Yeah, Canby House would be a good one. Um, Draper's yeah. Cabin. Yeah. Any kind of weird local legend you have. And that's what this feels like. It feels like a bunch of local legends. Yeah. What's uh, that place that everybody thinks is haunted in Indianapolis? It's uh, that the uh, something or other mansion where that rich guy shot himself. Uh, I don't know. Uh, also found in another book they did called Ghost Stories. And they just did a bunch of stuff. Oh. And it was just straight up for World of Dark and that's what I was gonna say. I'm gonna kind of miss that. There's another yeah. supplement called Urban Legends. Oh yeah, that is Legends. similar in, in regard mm -hmm. to that. Yeah. So they, they were they were all about with the World of Darkness, the core World of Darkness titles, not looking at like a vampire or changeling or werewolf so much, but these just the World of Darkness kind of supplements. These were honestly could border on brilliant. Yeah, a and, lot the, of these. and the best thing about these. So cool. Best thing about these, this works for literally any game in the world. Yep. I think the opinions have held up, but yeah. I think the presentation. Yeah. yeah. If you go back and <laughs> so. If we take it, you know, if we go back, if you go back and watch that video and see how it comes out there, uh, you bring it to us now. We've changed our system of grading. I would absolutely recommend it 100% to anyone who likes ghost stories or horror movies or just anything creepy because it really, really nails the atmosphere. Especially since in World of Darkness itself, you're just a guy yeah. dealing with some ridiculously heinous horror. And it's really, really well done. My recommendation hasn't changed. Again, the only reason that I would tend to direct people towards Chronicles of Darkness immediately was is because it's still being it's being supported for right. right forthcoming. Now. So uh, in, as future in future, but yeah, that's true. Uh, building off what you were saying, right? Uh, again, if you're going to you know want to play vampire 
or if you're going to want to play Werewolf or whatever, wholeheartedly recommend just getting the version from Chronicles of Darkness. But I really want to say I highly recommend going back and getting World of Darkness, specifically the Onyx Path set, just the book World of Darkness, and almost any supplement. Well, because a lot of the old supplements get are... World of Darkness, and get the World of Darkness just standalone supplements, because they are a great addition to your game shelf. Um, great stuff. Open Little, that door yeah, open and you will, have, you will have a blast. Get that stuff. If you want to see more from us, we're going to be doing more of these videos soon. We're going to be doing one for riffs. Woo! New roleplay roulettes. We're going to be doing new games. And we're going to be doing all kinds of other stuff. So if you want to see more of that, please click uh, subscribe. If you're feeling some kindness in your heart, give us a like. And we'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. You take all of the damage. Your body hits the ground after collecting more lead than an early era Warhammer enthusiast. You are extremely dead. Damn!